Hi, Jim from Droneland Australia here. Today I'm going to take you through uploading a map to Agremo, which is a great software for doing weed detection analysis on green on green weeds. So to get started, we're going to come over to Agremo and make sure that we're logged in. It's going to take us to this main screen. We're going to go up here to add field. I'm going to type in a name for the field, which will be demo here, a field description. So this is for a blackberry detection. Countries Australia, the crop can be blackberries or it's actually a pasture here. The location be up in the mountains or a city or a state there. The field owner and another ID, which is optional. So I'm going to hit save. So I'm going to navigate over to the paddocks that I've mapped. So it's this area here that I've mapped. It's about 60 hectares. I'm going to come over to the polygon tool, draw a polygon. I'm going to just click around the area of interest, the area that I mapped. All right, now that I've set my field boundary, I'm going to add a map. So this map name is going to be Warren Blackberry Weed Detection. I collected RGB data, which I'm going to use for this uh, Blackberry Weed Detection. Agremo prefers to work with RGB data, and RGB data are smaller data files than multispectral files. So we can do this Blackberry Weed Detection with just red, green, blue data, or the normal camera that the drone has. So I'm going to come over and hit choose a file. I'm going to navigate over to my external hard drive where I have the data saved. When we flew this mission, there were five flights. So each of them contained some of the PPK data files and then the RGB images. And I've taken the RGB images from all five of these folders and stored them in one folder and relabeled that. So these are all the RGB images of the flight. And then you would take this folder and export to a compressed zip folder. So once we've compressed the file to a zip file, this is the file that we're going to upload into a Gremo. So we'll go select this. Now it'll say the file name here. And then you just want to make sure that your camera type is on RGB. There are several different settings here, but RGB is what we're uploading and then hit save. So depending on your internet speed, this uh, and the amount of data that you're sending. Um, this upload could take anywhere from a couple hours to several. Um, so just give it some time and then we'll come back once this is uploaded. So the files have finished uploading and Agremo has finished the stitching with the files. So that took about 24 hours. So now we're gonna come back to our field, go down to our map. And so now we will have a map here underneath our field, which we'll click into. So as you can see, we have our field boundary here and the data that we captured with the Mavic 3 multispectral is now sitting on top of the satellite imagery. Now on this field, we have blackberries scattered across the hillside. So what we're gonna do is a blackberry weed detection analysis. So we'll come up to choose analysis, come over to weed detection. Analysis name will be blackberry, crop type pasture, growing stage, could be early, mature. I'll put mature and on the comment, I'm gonna say, please identify blackberries. So I'm gonna hit run analysis. A Gremo will take about 24 hours to run this analysis. So somebody on the back end is going to look at it, make sure the algorithm is correct and that everything's going to work with it. But I've already run the analysis on this. So I'll come over here. You'll get an email from a Gremo once the analysis is finished. 
And when you come back into the field, you would come down here to this little pie chart, click on this, and these will be the results of any analysis that you've run on this field. So I'll click down here. I'm going to look at the successful one that has been completed and show you the analysis results. So the results have loaded. And as you can see, Agremo has done a great job identifying the blackberries and painting them here. Agremo is one of the best softwares that I've seen doing green on green weed detection. So it doesn't look like it's picked up any of the trees and it's done a very accurate job of picking up the blackberries. And then on the stats for the analysis, so this field was 63 hectares. I did a blackberry weed detection. And you can see that we have 7.91 hectares of blackberries here. So I can use this data to go out manually spray the blackberries uh, with a drone, with a tractor, and then map it again the following year and look at the amount that we've been able to reduce the blackberry pressure by. You can also come in to Ag Tools, hit RX, and here you can export a prescription file that can be used in a drone or a tractor so that you can do a variable rate application. So I could say on the high weed pressure and the medium weed pressure, I'm going to apply 100 liters per hectare of an herbicide, and on the green I'll apply zero. And I can export this, and it'll export the files needed exactly for a DJI Agris T50 or any other DJI Agris drone to execute a variable rate application. But it's really helpful data that we have here. So there it is. That's how you use the Mavic 3 Multispectral, upload a map to a Gremo, and do a weed detection analysis on blackberries. For any more information, just head to our website at droneland.au or give us a call.